<laughs> Fantastic swim, Hannah. Well done. That's pretty much it. Yeah, I'm so, so happy with that, you know, to go from heats to semi finals, which was a, a big progression, and then semi finals to finals and go faster still. You know, that's what I'm looking for, especially in top international races. Trend tends to be your fastest swimmers in the semi final and not quite go as fast in the final, so I'm always looking for that progression. And I'm glad I was able to sort of practice that here because where else can you practice it? Well, obviously, you're a favourite to win that race, but uh, you've got the 400 coming later in the week, and be an even bigger favourite for that one. Yeah, that's definitely going to be a big ask, especially as I've now got another six more events to go, and I follow six, following six more days. So, yeah, it's quite challenging, obviously, having your main event on the last day and swimming on the you know, second main event on the first day, but, you know, this is practice for Worlds, and it's a great way to start it, it's just gaining more experience and just adding, adding more racing to my uh, tool bag. Is it good to get the ticket to Shanghai out of the way? And does that help? Yeah, it definitely helps being able to get the ticket to Shanghai. You know, it takes the pressure off for the rest of the week and having to try and get the ticket and qualify. So uh, it means that the rest of the week I can certainly enjoy it and relax. Just take each day as it comes and just break all my races. Yeah. We're still working on the fly, are we? Oh yeah, I always I always have to work on each stroke. I mean, you can't really train the front and I am without working on each stroke. Please no join us in welcoming this.